Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be explaining what an FRLA is and why it's important for your treatment during the AGA appliance and your controlled arch braces. First off, FRLA stands for Fixed Removable Lingual Arch. Oxymoron, maybe? The reason why it's called Fixed Removable is because there are parts that don't come out during treatment, and then there are other parts that are removable and can be adjusted as needed. So it has both components. When you are in the AGA appliance, you should receive a lower FRLA. Then, when you go into controlled arch braces, if you go into braces, that's when you'll receive an upper FRLA. The fixed aspect of the appliance are the bands that go around your very first molars. The removable part of the appliance is the actual wire. It's removable so that it can be adjusted or changed throughout your treatment as needed. Something to note is that the wire should never be touching your teeth, but it will rest lightly against your soft tissue. What, what does, it, does do? it do? First, it does provide expansion or contraction of the arch width in the molar area if needed. Depending on the size of your teeth, there is a suggested width measurement. The wire will be bent, it will be set, and then placed in your mouth to achieve that goal. Number two, the FRLA will also rotate or torque or untip your molars so that they are in the correct upright position. And three, lastly, it provides cross arch anchorage. And this is particularly important when using the controlled arch braces system. Controlled arch braces is a protractive braces system. So it is incredibly beneficial to have something like an FRLA helping to stabilize the wire and the stop blocks that are used in this braces system. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it or drop a comment below if you have a question. Thanks for watching guys.